Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back to my channel, UK Pinzi, and this is the BOTB Dream Car Competition Week 36. So we got the results. So we're gonna jump into it straight away and have a look where we have landed with the live stream and my first and the final video average. So let's have a look at that one and then straight away we will jump onto this week's picture because it's, it's quite interesting, yeah? Massive congratulations for Natalia Luberda for winning the Ford Focus ST edition uh, worth £43,000 plus 10k cash. This was the offer that they have, um, I think they have given last week. I can't even remember after seeing uh, <laughs> um, the results, but let's straight away jump on to the results. Not a good sign, uh, as you can see. Um, judges has gone more to the, the the right and more to below. I know I've got it. I even lost words. But this is kind of like an average I've showed on the first um, uh, short video I made. So it's it's in there. So I'll show you that one, you know, in a second. So the judges um, coordinate was X1348 and Y1392. Yeah, so let me show you the short video coordinate. So you can even have a look as well, yeah. That is, that's my short video coordinate. It's X1309, Y1378. So that's definitely in zone one didn't play <laughs> because uh, it, it's my bad yeah so I, I this is the second time it happened but it's all right um it's not the end of the world but let's just have a look um where we landed yeah so if i zoom it up this cross on here is the first and the final video average I've made and the one here is the live stream so they both landed in zone 3 so that's uh, not good but <laughs> so it happened so I don't know we're gonna have a look at the judging after and the rest random ones they just played so two landed on zone 2 because I just played like a cluster. So in total, as you can see, it's only seven. So if I had played 75, uh, I can't hide them, you know, so seven, yeah. So that's, that's, with the seven, it means with the free ticket, yes. Otherwise it's six in total I've played. So there you go. So let's have a look, the closest one. Yeah, the closest was in zone two. Um, that's X1277 and Y1347. Let me just zoom it up for you. Yep, there you go. Not happy about this, but at least um, one of the crosses are in zone 2. So let's jump on to the judging and see how it <laughs> happened. No. Right, so uh, you can see a tight cluster, but somehow uh, on here, you can see, see this area, it's got a tight cluster and um, who is this? Uh, Nigel Hicks um, going beyond again. I, I don't know something wrong with his specs, but you should uh, clarify that one. Um, that's that should be taken off, obviously. And there's these very low crosses, you know, and they are quite low. One from Matt Cannon, I think, is it? Oh no, I think that's. Um, looks like it's Matt Cannon. Yeah, that's Matt Cannon, and his colors are not that great. And Leo uh, Donnellan. They, they have gone quite low but this is the area the this is the area if you, as you if you have seen my first and the final average video that I made last Tuesday so this this cross from Liam Walsh that was the area that, I, that I've seen and that that area is good but then suddenly with, with the live stream was doing it jumped on more to the left and more uh, lower towards in this area 
so that happened you know like so but if you guys have seen my short the first impression short video I, I published last Monday that is where um, the area I played that cross have a look the short video then you can see I'm not lying yeah so have a look guys yeah so let's see the end who they've taken off yeah as I thought they took off Nigel Hicks and uh, they kept the rest as it is but this cross for Matt Cannon should have taken off as well that's my opinion guys yeah so yeah so that's why they ended up in the end on here so and that is closer to my short video average have a look guys yeah so let's jump onto this fixed picture so that's another easy picture so they might do something like this so bear in mind guys yeah right guys so uh, this is the picture so two players and eyes you know so that's the most important thing so we got some eyes but they are kind of blurred with this player for both eyes i don't know if this is a dodgy eye but <laughs> looks um, it's an eye but maybe it's been edited uh, obviously <laughs> and this player's eye is quite clear so he's the one who's just gonna um, determine the height and he is gonna be left and right obviously yeah so and this is red and white t-shirt player so let's start with the lines from him first because um, we need to judge where the blue player is looking at because this is a three-dimensional picture like a 3d picture and forget about the uh, the person or to the right who just kind of fit and um, I don't know what that what kind of a smile is that it's a smile or because of the the weather condition that uh, and but but that's not an actual background anyway <laughs> so that's a background they have put on here so let's start with the lines first and see how it goes yeah right there we go guys so the lines i was just thinking to put only one line for the um, red and white t-shirt player but then um, it's like a part of the eye you can you can see, see like from slightly also you know? if you zoom it up you can see so that's why i just um, put a parallel line just to show that the face because it's slightly tilted towards his right hand side um, so that's why i just put that as well because you can see that part of the eye and uh, with the uh, blue t-shirt player i've just looked into the eye that's kind of like looking straight but his the body and the head is tilted towards to his right side not what the picture wise i'm saying actually to his right but picture wise it to the left so that's why the angle has slightly changed uh apart, you know like if you had seen my short video i put a short video you know every monday so that the average has changed because i was just looking further and further by zooming it up you know of his eyes you know because that's that's the eyes like we need to kind of like <laughs> figure it out you know just about where is it going to more to the left or more to the right and the eye on to his um, right picture wise it just kind of like uh, has moved more towards to the left side so it could be a fixed eye by BOTB or maybe that's the way his, his eyes are like I don't know and uh, so accordingly that's why i put these lines guys so for me it looks perfect i don't know <laughs> how you guys feel about it but you can you know um, leave comments below after i this video yeah? so let's put the cross right guys so that is the cross so let's take the lines off for a second there we go so he's not looking too high by the way uh, because it's it's kind of like um, if, you, if you look at the picture and and his, his body angle it's, it's kind of like looking slightly like just slightly upward and directly at him you know so it's kind of the ball either it's coming on his way or passing the blue player that's what uh, he's looking at but I don't think he has headed the ball 
because it's it's on his way only for the red and white t-shirt player yeah so and the guy in blue just missed that kind of a reaction what i would say but it could be other way around <laughs> but you know like uh, with this picture that's what i'm thinking because um of the the two people's uh, facial reaction so that's what i was thinking right so let's put the dragon ball ball and you guys the dragon ball ball and uh, let's see how it looks like if you put the lines back again so there you go so then you know this is like a close-up picture as well guys yeah so you need to remember that as well not a far away picture um, and so accordingly so we have to imagine the size of the ball roughly but not entirely don't need to but not just to figure out how close the ball is uh, for both of them you know so that's why you know if you look at the uh, the green circle that's kind of like slightly really uh, low on that that size but it's going to be the ball you know so it's not too close to the blue player and not even close to the red and white t-shirt player so that is kind of like a good average i would say but leave your comments guys below and i will reply for every comment it doesn't matter yeah and thank you everyone uh for supporting my channel like giving likes subscribing thanks so much guys yeah so you are supporting me to grow my channel and i will do my best to get a winner that i promise you guys that's why i'm making this video every week yeah so hopefully you had a great weekend guys and a week ahead so i will catch you on sunday the live stream every sunday there's a live stream going on at 6 pm so if you don't know if you're new to the channel yet yeah, so you can consider subscribing as well i know that so many people are watching a lot of people subscribe so there's no charge for subscribing it's only the membership <laughs> you have to pay but you can subscribe it's free and and you press the bell icon so you get notified as well each and every time if you're a video tv player yeah? so guys yeah so thanks for watching and catch you on sunday yeah so take care bye for now